Good morning, everybody. Happy Monday. It is about 6 a.m. here. I just woke up. I'm having the major heartburn and indigestion like normal and came in a little bit later for a snuggle after daddy left for work and we are here with the water. Breakfast um, was bacon and some eggs. Ian and I are not big breakfast people. Seth's not either. Um, but I figured Ian requested a bacon and egg scramble this morning and I needed to go ahead and eat. It does help get rid of the heartburn and indigestion that I have. But I'm always just so nauseous in the morning and this morning was no different. So we have three eggs that we are cooking up and the bacon crumbles that we get these ones i think were from sam's club or costco i'm not sure i just heat these a little bit in the skillet to get a little bit of crispiness to them and then i add in the egg i don't have any milk in here or anything i prefer my eggs without milk seth is always adding milk to the scrambled eggs when he makes them i think it takes away taste if anything sometimes i add some butter I think it just tastes amazing. Look at that bump shot, guys. I am 29 weeks. <laughs> I will be 30 weeks on Thursday already. It's kind of crazy how quickly it's going by, honestly. <laughs> um, but we are just going to get these eggs all cooked up pretty quickly in a hot pan. Here is Ian's plate. He requested strawberries. I was too lazy to clean the ones that we have in the fridge off. So he has applesauce. <laughs> but he does really love bacon and eggs in the morning. I am just heating up a Mission Low Carb Tortilla for my little bit of eggs and bacon. A slice of American cheese make a little breakfast taco it's basically no carbs right there and even the blackberries which these have been living in my fridge and they really needed to get eaten um real and raw for you guys today this is my insulin that i take every day i take a long acting and then um, twice a day and then i take a short acting with all three meals so that is the insulin and then obviously the acid reducer I'm living on as well as the Tums and I am max amount every 24 hours on both of these right now and honestly it doesn't matter what I eat I have to take them after breakfast I moved on to making my daily list um, you might think this is silly it's okay um, this really, really helps me stay on track for the day, especially days that I really need to get things done. Like today, I, I just want to get the house clean, the dishes done. I want to get a lot of like Logan's new things that we kind of have washed up and remember, oh, I have to take my medicine, my other medicines and I have to take this and I need to do that. And oh yeah, I have things I need to move and drying things and washing things and it's just easy pregnancy brain is very very real don't let anybody tell you it's not because i don't remember what i did yesterday and lists help here are the medications i have some insulin medicine a vitamin and then a blood pressure pill that i have to take every day getting on to Ian's um or er, Logan I'm already doing it I've already done it multiple times I have called Ian Logan and Logan Ian this is the bedding that we received as a gift and we are getting this washed up we are slowly starting to work on the nursery um 30 weeks is this week and Ian actually came at 33 weeks when he was born obviously he didn't come home till right around 40 weeks he was in the NICU for 60 some odd days but 
we are trying to get as ready as possible. It's 11.30. We're going to bake something. I just went and sat in the nursery and fell asleep for a while. <laughs> in the lazy boy. So... We have stuff to make Rice crispy Treats. I've got cake muffins, chocolate chip muffins. I don't want to make a whole cake. We've got brownie mix. Cookie brownie mix. Ian, do you want some rainbow muffins? Or chocolate chip ones? We haven't even touched them. Well, they're for the Rice Krispie Treats. We're not going to just eat marshmallows, Goof. Marshmallows are yummy by themselves. I think I'm going to make these. Okay, so right now, I have to get the dishwasher put away real quick and then load it again because I've got a couple dirty dishes up here. Keep it on it. Keep it on it. And then we're going to do the muffins. I decided on the chocolate chips um ian didn't show much interest and the yeah the packaging exploded on me there i was just wiping it off but i was i'm really craving like something apple cinnamony or something like a pumpkin-y i i'm already ready for a fall guys and we haven't even had a ton of hot weather here yet this summer um, but it's actually coming towards the end of the week and the weekend we haven't had any rain. That's a whole nother story. We're in the middle of like a mild drought in Illinois. But yeah, we're just gonna make these muffins. And I am not a baker. I hope they turn out. This this um, batter looks really, really thin to me, but I followed the directions, I promise, which were very minimal directions but it's okay so we are gonna get these going they actually sound really really delicious and look at that bump here are the uh little muffins all finished and we are gonna let these cool while and helps me with some laundry he has been the biggest helper lately um i have trouble bending over i'm having trouble standing up <laughs> like getting up off of the couch or whatever he's showing off he's like he knows i'm recording he absolutely loves he's like always like hi guys hi guys i'm Ian. and he's such a happy little guy we are so so lucky <laughs> to have such a happy semi well behaved child <laughs> no, i'm just kidding he, he is very well behaved he's just a goofy little guy and he's very happy but he has been such a big help already he is so so excited about being a big brother and earlier he was actually reading to my stomach how to touch uh never touch a dragon book and he was reading to logan and he was like mommy i cannot wait till he's here and i can really read to him so it's really cute but i am getting the uh, bedding that is logan's thrown in um this is yeah like i said this is what we received as a gift i'm gonna try to get his crib all made up and uh here we have the muffin disaster i accidentally overcooked them and burnt them on the bottom so we are just gonna eat the top and they taste delicious um so we're getting like half muffin bites today oh uh, you know i'm not a baker it's okay it's mountain dew time it's about 12 30 and it's lunchtime and i need the caffeine <laughs> this is ian's plate he has some of these like white castle chicken rings we get these out to schnook's grocery store oranges carrot sticks and some white cheddar popcorn and I am trying out these zucchini pizza tots. I love zucchini. And I saw these in the store and I was like, oh, I want to have these. Put these in the air fryer. Here is my lunch. Carrots with some uh, ranch cup left over from the baby shower this last weekend. And the rest of those blackberries that I've slowly been munching on today because 
they are getting very, very soft. I got a little hungry, <laughs> so I had a snack, some peanut butter, just some saltine crackers, and then this cheese ball left over from the baby shower. I know it's sharp cheddar. I don't know what it's coated with. I think maybe some almonds, but either way, it was delicious. We're in the nursery, and Logan's bedding is done. I thought I'd show you. This came with it. This is just a little sleep sack. This came with the set. Little lion. Here is one of the sheets. And then just another plain gray one. I must have dropped the bed skirt. Hold on. Here is the crib skirt. And then here is the comforter. It's so cute. I am actually exhausted, guys. Seth will be home here in a little bit. And then I'm gonna keep vlogging, but whew, I am worn out. This was dinner tonight. The boys had um, grilled hot dogs and chips. I had this salad. This is the Buffalo Ranch Taylor Farms kit. I did end up adding extra ranch, some unbreaded chicken tenders that I air fried, and then I did make some tacos out of these carb wraps. Slowly going through this kid's clothes. These are all um, 10 to 12s. These are all, most of these, yeah, these are all eights. So these are mediums, these are larges. So this jacket is a large as well. Don't mind his bed. It's a mess, but we're starting to get his go bag ready for when baby comes. He's going to go stay with grandma for a few days. So we have bought a couple of new things, some new undershorts, um, the blue, red, and gray shirts are new. Those two pairs of shorts, I think the ones I got from Costco the other day, those are new. Getting it ready. Hey, right, Ian, let me see. Ian just pulled his tooth out finally. It was been loose forever. So I want this and so one, he gets to pick three to this well, one and this study one. the dinos. Make sure you know you got the ones that you want. This one, this one. Um, Surprised you didn't want it. Have you looked at all of them, Ian? I want this one, this one, and the Taiwan dog. Oh my god, Those are the ones child. You want? Yes, I want to open the Rocky Souls first. I suppose you don't want the baby Indominus and the baby uh, T Rex. No, I want the pillow. Right. The choice is made. I was just popping on to say good night. Thank you so much for coming along today. It's been a long day and I'm actually very, very tired. Um, we're about to watch Beat Bobby Flay and go to bed it is eight o'clock i'm up tired yeah okay, i hope you guys enjoyed let me know what you think of this like full real life day i pretty much filmed everything that i did today which wasn't a lot but was a lot considering i'm having trouble moving around but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you later